we did it. We really did it. I still can't believe we got 100,000 subscribers. Like, I don't even know what this means. Am I a celebrity now? Hey Siri, what's the first thing to do as a celebrity? Sell your soul to the Illuminati and sacrifice. Okay, that's enough of that. Just two years ago, I had like a hundred subs and here you are with a whole freaking army. Oh yeah, what do I call you guys? Hmm, jawbreaker juice, jawbreakers, sugar. I'll call you guys cavities or cavity gang. I don't know, I'm new to this. If you got anything better, just put it in the comments below. All right, cue the intro. Okay, for this special, I wanted to do something special. I honestly didn't know what to do, so I just typed in 100K special on YouTube and I saw that Jaden Animations reacted to her old drawings and I was like, Jaden, I'm stealing your idea. Today, I'm gonna show you guys my cringy drawings from middle school. Freaking middle school. So back then, I had this composition notebook that I drew in and I wanna slap my past self for it because who draws in a journal with lines in it? Anyways, let's look at the first few pages. So we got a comic here in... <laughs> Bro, this is so dumb. All right, so the first the first panel, you got this dude in 2013. His name is Jack, apparently. He's over here winking at me like he think he really he really doing something with that. Then a year goes by and he, he let himself go a little bit, you know? Oh my God, why'd I draw him like that? He's built like a t piece of toast. And look at his nipples, bro. Look at, ugh. Look at like eyebrows on his chest. Anyways, he let himself go. He's eating a hamburger. He's scratching himself like he, he stopped caring. I don't know. And then 2015 was just not his year. It just went downhill. Like he, he can't even get up. He's built like a the poop emoji. What was I going for for this? Pet? What was the point of this comic? Anyway, he's sweating. He got the meat sweats. And then here comes the punchline. You ready? My 600 pound life featuring Jack's life. You get it? Me neither. And then we got this thing. I don't even know what this is. I just tried to draw something as ugly as I could. So I made him bald, gave him nasty unibrow, chapped lips. This is so hard to look at, ugh. His eyes are so dead, like he's about to do something unwise. I don't know. All right, so here's where the fun begins, all right? So I had this character named Pedro the Penguin, right? And this was my downfall. Like this is, this is, this is what started the cringe, okay? So with this being my new original character, I was like, I gotta draw him every time. So every time I drew, I felt like I had to, he had to be like the main character. So I drew whatever this is. Looked like he just popped 30 per 30s having a whole anxiety attack. What is he thinking about? What it? Oh my God. I don't, I don't even know, bro. I, I guess it's supposed to represent his thoughts. He's just, it's just like too much for him. If I had a kid and I saw this in his drawing notebook, I'd be very worried. I don't know. Back then when I drew, I'd never had like a motive. <laughs> I don't know what this is. Like, look at that. What is that? Daffy Duck facing forward? Like, don't cringe yet. It gets worse. Like what? Look at this. Look, oh my God. I really thought this was, I really thought this was cool back then. Over here winking at me, like, oh, look at the hat. Doesn't that look familiar? I'm embarrassed to even wear this. I'm gonna take this off. That's crazy. I remember drawing this too, like thinking, man, this is so fire. This is gonna get a million likes on DeviantArt. I don't know, this, this picture gives me dude who tries so hard to be your friend vibes. Hey, when I go snowboarding after school, like get off my screen with that, bro. <laughs> and then we, of course, you know, middle school farts, farts are funny. I drew, I drew Pedro farting. Nothing, not, not much to be said here. And then we got another drawing, with, which I thought was cool back then. I actually spent so much time working on this. I was, I was going for a cool approach, if you couldn't tell. And then we got. I, I'm just gonna flip the page, if you don't mind. So after drawing Pedro a bunch, I was like, you know what? It's time to introduce some more characters, and that's what I did. So we got one of them, his name is Larry. <laughs> Larry is a serious n***, okay? He's different. Larry don't play around. You can see I tried to give him like, I don't know, like some kind of sergeant haircut or whatever. How you a penguin and you still got a messed up hairline? Nature just hate you. So this is supposed to be Pedro's friend or whatever. And you got it. You got Pedro bullying him right here, trying to, you know, I don't know. I don't know the dynamic be between these two. Looking back, Pedro kind of sucks. Like, why? You can't do that to your friend. I know his head is sizzling right now. So then I added another character, and I was like, we need some more. We need, we need a female in here. And so I drew Leah. Anyway, let's check out her design. Oh. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> 
<laughs> oh my god, bro. What is this? Looking back, this kind of looks like Margaret. And then, so I had three characters now, right? So I was like, okay, I got to draw them all together. Yeah, it was Earth Day when I do this. And I was like, I'm going to make something for Earth Day like anybody cared. And I drew this masterpiece. And oh my god, it's so bad. Look, oh, Pedro, Pedro's lips. Look at that. You got Larry here about to commit domestic violence with that fist. Put that fist down. And you got Leah here being Leah. And you probably think, oh, I can't, it can't get any worse, right? It gets worse, bro. Oh my god, what? Oh, bro, what was I on? I remember I showed this to my mom, too. I showed this to my mom, too. And I remember her, like, she gave me, like, a surprise reaction. <laughs> I, I thought nothing of it. I thought nothing of it. I was just like, I'm drawing... I'm drawing the penguin. It's the penguin gang. But I remember drawing that. I was like, bro, this is what I'm this is my masterpiece. This is like the best thing I've ever drawn. It's so cool. It's so edgy. Look at him sagging. I think he's fine with that. I drew a couple penguins and all of a sudden they on some gang shit. I swear I'm not a fairy. I just really thought these were cool. I'm not a fairy. And then we got Leah again. Like she... It, it just doesn't end. It just doesn't end. I don't know. I don't, I, don't, I kind of don't like Leah. No, she kind of doing too much. And then I was like, I don't draw Larry enough. So I started drawing him a little more. And it, apparently Larry's depressed. Like, he's just going through it. This man cracking at the at the edges and stuff. He needs some cocoa butter with that. And here we go. Pedro back at it with the gang stuff. Look at that hand. It's so ugly. I still can't draw hands though. So yeah, I, that's expected. <laughs> Oh my god, why is his thumb bigger than the rest of his fingers? And he got that Charlie Brown unibrow. And then you got Larry in his underwear. I don't know why, I was, so, I was like obsessed with drawing people doing the thumbs down. I didn't want to draw a middle finger, that was like the closest thing to a middle finger, I guess. And we got this. I, I think this is from that meme. Back then there was this meme called, you know, 2017 in their memes. Autistic screeching, and I just kind of replicated it with Pedro. <laughs> And then we got an actually slightly decent drawing here. It's, it's supposed to be me as an anime. And I think I got the face from Google Images. I didn't even make that on my own. I just copied an image from Google. <laughs> oh yeah, back then boss mode was like my, my name that I named myself. Like across all platforms and stuff. If you ever got killed by someone named Boss Mode in GTA from 360, yeah, that was me. That name alone just shows how old I was. And there's more characters, you just wait. I made a new character, his name was Bill, I think. And I wanted to diversify the penguins a little bit, so I made him blind for some reason. I guess I was feeling a little inclusive and I just drew a blind penguin. And I gotta say, he kinda, he kinda cool. He got the sunglasses on, he got that smirk, he, he chilling. And then here's all four of them together. And here go Leah again with them. Get out of here with that. And yeah, those are feet. They might look like pants or like legs. No, they're just feet. So I had that cast for a while. And then later on, I was like, I need to add another female. You know, we're getting tired of Leah. You know, she's kind of, she's kind of a whore. We need a female penguin who's a little, who's a little loopy, a little quirky, if you will. <laughs> okay, this is, this is Molly, the psychotic penguin. And I don't know what I was going for. She got a green bean stuck in her throat. I guess that's supposed to be her tongue. As you females will say, it's giving crackhead energy. And here's Molly again. <laughs> Why all my penguins have to be so thick? This was so unnecessary. I remember drawing this one in my living room. I mean, looking back, it's not that bad. I was proud of it back then. I had to do another cast photo, so I drew them all together again. And look at look at Bill swagging out on us, showing off his muscles. Think he tough. And here Pedro go again sagging. Pedro kind of trying too hard. I don't like it. Oh yeah, if you're wondering why Larry is so short, so uh, I forgot to draw him. I didn't really like Larry at all. Like I made this character to be like the serious one, and I ended up hating him for some reason. And so this time around, I forgot. Ab I just neglected him. I forgot about him this time, and I had to erase half of Molly to put him in because I felt bad. And here we got this cool pick of Bill. I'm telling you, Bill is kind of cool. All these other characters are trash, but Bill, he can stay. He's just chilling. This was actually kind of decent. And oh, oh no. I freaking made descriptions of each character. So we got Pedro. He, he was supposed to, back then he was supposed to be like pretty much me, but in the penguin form. So anything that Pedro likes is pretty much what I liked back then. So back then I liked Lime Green. His hobbies, drawing, video games, reading, playing the trumpet. His dislikes, liars, too much noise, unnecessary work, and racist. <laughs> All right, favorite foods. This, this is where I got a little fat. I drew, I made a whole list. Hungry ass. Dream car, Lamborghini guard, or spider. And then we got Larry, and I tried to make him as boring as possible. Like, he likes the museum and the library. <laughs> I hated this kid. I just made him so trash. 
Like, look, I made him hate TV and candy. Yo, look how much of a loser this guy. His favorite color is light brown. And we got Leah, and her dream car is a Volkswagen Beagle, Beetle, because back then I thought that was a girly car. And we got Bill, and I don't know why he even has a favorite color. Like, his favorite color is white, but I'm pretty sure he would have never seen white before if he's blind. And we got Molly, and I just made her, I just made her as violent as possible. She likes hunting, skydiving, and out of nowhere, assassinating. Is I just put that in there like it's no big deal. Favorite food, raw pig and tree moss. And there was one more character that I added before I ended this whole whatever this is. And his name was Isaac, the chicken. You can tell I got a little risky with this one. And I don't know why I made him dress like a substitute teacher. Look at his, look how he rolled up his sleeves. Look at his posture. I made him pose like he's a good neighbor or something. <laughs> he looks like he'll make you a casserole when you move into the neighborhood. And I didn't really draw this character that much, only twice. Once is right here and he's, he, 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 he's doing what chickens do. Look at his feet. Cafeteria forks. And his other one's pretty much Pedro just judging him. What a strange penguin. I know Pedro ain't talking with that sweater on. What what's what is what kind of sweater? Is this a turtleneck? Or like what is this? You got no room to be talking. And that's it. That's all I could find from the whole penguin phase I had back then. Anyways, again, I really appreciate you guys. Thank you for a hundred thousand subscribers. Trust me, this is just the beginning. We're gonna take over the world. Like literally, we're making an empire right now. I wanna thank all my friends and family who supported me this whole way. And I wanna thank you, you watching this right now. Yes, you in the white t-shirt. Thank you for clicking that subscribe button. Thank you for liking my videos. Thank you for supporting. All right, this is getting corny. I said thank you like a thousand times. Okay, see y'all later.